It's now nine o'clock on the 19th of March 2022 and for the final hours of Pisces we have a splendid 89% waning gibbous moon. as seen through the trees. 5.55 on the 20th of March and a beautiful disc of the moon. Now 6.07, so it's sunrise and here we are on South Sea Beach West. Now this must be the east, and there's the sun rising over there. We can see the sun coming up over the pier, peering up for us, making an appearance. 6:13 on the 21st of March. 2022 and today is the first day of Aries and the new astrological year okay and some people will enjoy a dip in the ocean this morning So today, 20th March, is the first day of the astrological year, the beginning of 2022. And the year of the Ram. So arise the astrological year of 2022. This year, is a six year. Yes, we add up all the, the, the numbers, six. Where one will be busy with life and making plans, looking to what is on the horizon for them. In the first year of these astrology videos, I looked at atmospheres for that coming month. In the second year, I looked at the ruling planet for each zodiac sign. So this year, I will concentrate on each of the 12 houses, one for each month. So today, we'll look at the first house, which is ruled by Aries, the Ram, and the planet Mars. The first house is created in one's astrological chart at the moment one is born and starts at the ascendant coming over the horizon and it lasts for 30 degrees. The first house concerns our first cosmic impression. It could be called the house of self. I will leave a link below the video for those who want the full details of houses and how they work. So, today, looking at the first house as the sun rises for Aries. And some locals take a dip in the fresh sea.
I wonder what the temperature is in there. So one swimming, the other two, the others are a bit hesitant. Well, a very positive start for the month of Aries. So we'll leave our bathers there for the day, for the moment. Now 14 minutes. After the official sunrise at 6.07. So now 6.21 as I speak. And so starts a six year at six degrees Celsius. And still visible the moon. It looks to be fading out into the blue. Yes. So here we see the moon after a night's work and it'll soon be clocking out. In a few hours, I should imagine. 6.25 First day of the Aries A squirrel Looking for the first food of the day So here we are for some more of looming weather. Wonderful atmosphere. So 647. on the common and looking for the moon, but the moon seems to have faded into the blueness of the sky. Six fifty and sunrise as seen along Osborne Road next to the Queen's Hotel. 6.53 and we can see that the sun is rising similarly to the direction that the the moon was rising yesterday and I will add that moon rise next on the video now 7.32 
can see the sun is in a similar position to where the moon was at nine o'clock last night. So just 10 hours ago. Twentieth March, twenty twenty two, seven thirty three in the morning. Beautiful beginning to the astrological year. Twelve o'clock on the twentieth of March, and all the daisies or the day's eyes are facing the sun. 12.04 on the 20th of March 2022 and we're just eight minutes away from solar noon and so this is about as high as the sun will get today it's it's now traveling on the equator circle according to the Gleason map and its speed will be 1000 and about 1038 miles an hour as it travels across the sky over in that direction So I'd like to get the solar noon from two locations today. So we're going down to the um, the round tower. 12, 12, and this is the moment of solar noon. 12, 13, so just after solar noon, and we can see how high the sun is from this vantage point which is due west of our last position time now is 12 20 so eight minutes after solar noon and we're west of our position our last position and we can see how high the sun is up there at the moment beautiful day Yes, yeah, so we're about two kilometres from our last position, videoing from the Round Tower in Old Portsmouth, good old Portsmouth. So, 20th of March. 2022 and the spring equinox just after solar noon 12 25 and now it's about 10 degrees celsius on the beach Followed by a D'Agostino Italian ice cream. 12.47. So from this position, we see the small local sun. That's about 51 kilometers in diameter. Um, chasing the moon on a similar circuit across the sky. We saw the moon just over there this morning. Yes, the, the disk, the small local disk of the moon was seen this morning in that direction. Yes. Diameter of that small local 
moon is about 51 kilometers. So 21 tomorrow and it's the 20th of March today and talking about the, the sun and the moon according to the flat earth theory and reality. 1741 on the 20th of March 2022 spring equinox and the sun is, is seen to be disappearing in a westerly direction one full reflection on the water Still some moments until the actual moment of sunset, officially. Now just 34 minutes until the official sunset. So it's time now, 17.43. And the sunset at 18.17. And from this position, we can see that the sun has moved significantly since solar noon. Next to the square tower, with 20 minutes until sunset. 1757. And we have a shop with some crabbers, I think, looking for crabs in the water. Now, 1800 hours and 17 minutes until the official sunset on the 20th of March, 2022. eighteen oh seven so just ten minutes until the official sunset this evening which will be at eighteen seventeen and just as a reminder this is the spring equinox twentieth of March and the sun according to the flatter theory and the Gleason map spirals between two circles a circle over here which is called the Tropic of Capricorn and a circle over here which is called the Tropic of Cancer and right in the middle is the circle that is called the equator circle and that's where we are today remember on the 21st of june last year we did see the sun setting over here that's on my videos and december 21st the sun was setting over here west of Ride. Yes. In fact, there are about 182 spiral runs or spiral circles from the Tropic of Cancer to the Tropic of. Capricorn. Eight minutes until sunset and it looks as if the sun is getting slightly compressed from our perspective and uh, perhaps going behind some clouds. 
in the distance. Now last night the the sun was much lower over the sixth window of that building. Yes, the last glimpses of the solar disk were seen disappearing just above the sixth window last night. So last moments of the sun disk, last 15% still visible and it will be perceived to be setting beyond the seventh window this evening. That's it, it's now just sort of disappearing into the mist of a cloud. Last moments of the sun disk still visible about 5% with the naked eye seen quite clearly through the mist of the cloud in the distance over the seventh window of that building so another rooftop sunset or should I say a Gosport rooftop sunset there we go it's, no, it's now it's vanished into the thickness of the atmosphere. And there we go. Eighteen seventeen, the official moment of sunset and Tonight we've seen the, in the past 17 minutes, we've seen the, the sun descend and veer to the right. Yes, yeah, so it's curveballing to the right, which conforms exactly to the flat earth theory that a small local sun circles around a flat plane in a circular motion between the two tropics Capricorn and Cancer every six months to return and so that concludes nine months of filming these sunsets and they're all on the channel yes and the the moon will probably make an appearance in about three hours. 18.23 and just a reminder that today there were 12 hours and 9 minutes of sunlight of daylight. So 13 minutes after sunset, 1840 with the lights of Ride just across the Solent over there in the hovercraft path. Notably this morning I was up at the crack of dawn. Yes, crack of dawn being 535. Lovely 
glow on the water. We can see Spinnaker Tower in the distance there. And now it's 1850. This is the official moment of dusk. And just up there we have a wandering star and a plane traveling above it. There we go. Dusk. The day of the equinox. Five minutes after dusk. Twenty one twenty eight, and we have moonrise. Yes. Off of the beach. This is South Sea East Beach, and the uh, the sun was coming up over in this direction this morning by the pier, uh, over the pier, and here we have the moon coming up, clocking in for a night's work. It's interesting because it's an 82% waning gibbous moon this evening and that is where we saw the sun rising not so many weeks ago and now the moon on a similar circuit so our spring equinox moon in that direction and over here, oh, you may not be able to see this with this camera, but over here we have Orion, the three stars, one, two, three. The belt of Orion and the moon. 22-24. And the silvery moon is well on its journey, clocking in for the night for the spring equinox last hours 20th of March 2022 and directly overhead you may not see this with with the camera but directly overhead is Polaris and the plough 